G'day guys, I'm Andrew, and in this series of videos we're going to look at generating and playing sound stimuli, uh, which are used throughout a whole bunch of auditory neuroscience experiments. So we're going to use essentially three programs, we're going to use Audacity, Python, and PsychoPy to generate and then play the sound stimuli. This series of videos is going to be conceptually quite similar to my other series of videos where we look at visual stimuli using Python and PsychoPy. So if you're also interested in doing visual stimulation, uh, hey, just pop over to there and um, you know, have, a, have, a, have a look and see what, uh, if anything is of, in, of interest there for you. Now, for this series of videos, what do we need? We need Audacity. Uh, I know that Audacity is, uh, you can just download that from Google. So type in Audacity, we can see uh, it here, A-U-D-A-C-I-T-Y, Audacity. Um, I know it works on Mac OS and uh, Windows. Your Linux distributions, I'm not so sure, but um, we're going to confine ourselves to Mac and Windows for this series of videos. So grab Audacity. And the other thing you're going to need is Python. We're going to code all of our stuff in Python 3.7. So it, uh, if you can get, I know it should work 3.65 and later, but at time of uh, recording this, which is end of July, no, sorry, end of January 2019, um, we're running 3.7. And the other thing that you're going to need is PsychoPy. All right. So... If you're not sure how to get Python or PsychoPy, either just leave a comment in this video and we can go through it in this series of videos. I do go through it in the first couple of videos in um, my visual stimulation uh, playlist. So if you just want to have a look at using PIP to um, install PsychoPy and Python, uh, Python and PsychoPy, then um, uh, you can just jump over there. Now. We'll leave this video here. This is just an introductory video. In the next video, we're going to use Audacity to create quite a simple, although still commonly used, uh, noise stimulus. We'll see how we go about doing that. All right, so uh, I'll leave this video here and uh, we can catch up in the next video. See you then.